In this tutorial, you will learn to create a form library. On the home page of your SharePoint site, go to the left-hand side, which is the Quick Launch. The very first link in this section is View All Site Content. Click that link. The All Site Content page displays. Directly below the title is a Create button. Click the Create button. The Create page opens with several items that can be created. Under the Libraries section, click the second link. That is Form Library. The new page displays with four categories of items to be completed. The very first category is Name and Description. You must give your Form Library a name and a description. I will call mine New Hire. Now, I will give it a description so that users of this site will know what types of forms are saved in this library. I will call mine All New Hires Use These Forms. The next category is Navigation. Here you can specify whether a link to this form library will appear on the Quick Launch section of your home page. The default setting is Yes. I will keep this setting because a link under the Quick Launch gives myself and users a one-click access to my library. The next section is Document Version History. This will specify whether a version is created each time you edit a file in the document library. The default setting for this section is No. I will keep this setting because I will not be tracking any versions of my forms. If you are sharing this library with other users and would like to track edits and changes to forms, it's a good idea to set this to Yes. The final section is Document Template. This section is set by default to Microsoft Office InfoPath Form. There is no other selection here, so we do not need to make any changes. To verify that, if you click the down arrow, you can see the only listing is Microsoft Office InfoPath Form. Now click the Create button. The new Hire Form Library page displays.